What's up YouTube? Got a small unboxing here today. Just arrived and I'm pretty excited to get this open. It's a little change up to the gear, something a little unexpected and I'm not even sure if it's going to work for Airsoft. But uh, we'll take a look at what it is and I'm already telling just through this box. It's a lot smaller than I thought it would be and it should, should be fine though. Let's get it open first of course before that start making opinions about it. This is a very dull knife, I will say. It's never been sharpened. That was a pain. Alright, here it is. It is an MSA gas mask. And the lens is really yellow. It's kind of nasty looking, but uh, I plan on replacing it anyway with a, a tinted black lens. I thought it was made of glass, but it's actually, it seems to be made of some kind of rubber rubber material so I think um I'm not sure this will deflect BBs I have to do like a shooting test or something but uh I think like 400 oh, I don't know it's it's pretty thick I don't think a BB will go through this necessarily but this is the MSA gas mask and I bought this because I'm inspired to do a uh, Battlefield 3 Russian engineer kit and also I seen some guys on a umbrella umbrella corp airsoft team wear these with the tinted mask and pretty much inspired me to get it so like a like an airsoft Russian loadout. And this one's got the filter. Now um, I was looking for these for kind of a while, and uh, they're pretty pricey. I only paid about forty bucks for it, and I've seen them for like a hundred bucks, five hundred bucks, some pretty crazy prices on it. But uh, this is a good size, the the medium. So right there, medium. It says MSA in the corner. And uh, it looks pretty good. I didn't know that it was like all rubbery, but actually it's probably a good thing and will flex better when I put a helmet over the top and what other stuff I decide to do with it. Also, it's good. I could probably wear full seal goggles on the inside of the mask so that they'll let me use this in game. And I honestly think this will deflect BBs. And when I get the tinted um, black lens, it's going to look super badass and uh, it'll pretty much be good to go. So I hope you like this short unboxing, this, this really neat gas mask. It is my favorite style gas mask, the MSA style from Battlefield 3, the Russian Engineer, and other popular media and stuff. I'm not sure this is an American gas mask, I'm pretty sure it is American. It says a bunch of stuff right here about MSA. So I guess it's got a working filter, so this will work. Yeah, I'm pretty excited about this mask. I really, really like the look of it. And I don't know if I can, if it's supposed to be yellow like that, maybe it's like supposed to be like a high res, so you could see, you know, new yellow lenses. Good for night as well. Maybe I can use this in a night game, but I don't think it's gonna breathe really well. So it's really hot right now. I'm gonna bring the, or film the rest of this video in my gear to just see what it looks like, see if I look like I'm in Battlefield. YouTube, I'm your host, Spinxer Cell, back again. Got my gear on. I just want to show you what my mask looks like. Alright, I really doubt you can hear me, so I'm going to talk as loud as I can. This is the gas mask, the Russian. Russian engineer. Yes, mess. Inspired by Battlefield 3. Then I got my brand new EOTech replica. And my recent tool. And they have it.
us a brief look at my your gas mask. I think that it looks pretty cool. You know, Russian engineer inspired. And uh, I want to get the, the black tinted lens so that you know it just looks cooler, you know, like in the game. And uh, it's made of rubber, so it will take BB hits during game, I hope. You could breathe all right in it. It works obviously just fine. Yeah, I wouldn't really recommend it all the time. But I've seen a lot of people do it, like uh, Resident Evil loadout. I've seen these masks, and I'm trying to do Russian engineer, not the three style. Or at least just try to get the head thing going. Maybe I'll get like a Russian inspired BDU. Anyway, hope you enjoyed this brief look at this MSA gas mask. Stay tuned for more content and maybe some gameplay if it cools down. And I hope you also got a good look at the, the new EO tech on my honey badger.